Hello, everybody. I hope all finds you well. And to one side of me. There I am. I know we're playing like a special shell card game where we rotate. We have had technical issues this morning. Um, I'm going to say, oh, I could pretend and tell you it's been hilarious. It hasn't been. And that's okay. It's tested our ability for to keep a smile on our face. Welcome today to our Healing Through Love show. And we're here to increase awareness within the community around providing family and domestic violence survivors with a soft place to land and to offer advice on services available to these survivors and their families. And we're so grateful that uh, business owners um, from near and far have um, offering their services and paying it forward to uh, help and uh, support survivors of domestic and family violence. So each week on the show, we interview some wonderful supporters of our Pamper Days and we learn more about their personal journeys, about their businesses and why they are supporting Healing Through Love to assist survivors. Excellent. Thanks, girls. Now, my comrades are going to pop off the screen. One's going to chat in the chat box and the other one's going to, you know, move things around so that we keep going. And I'm going to introduce our fantastic next guest. So we've got two lady, lovely ladies here today. We've got Marianne Till and Lindley Evans. We're going to start today with Marianne Till, a Reiki practitioner, hypnosis and momentum coach. We have to find out what that is. And she's passionate about helping women just rediscover themselves and transform their lives and flourish. Marianne has spent her working life as an educator and alter alternative. I'd love to know what that's about, alternative health practitioner. And she knows how life-transforming coach Reiki and hypnosis can be. Marianne uses these tools for herself after going through a lots of trials and tribulations. Marianne, welcome. Thank you very much. I'm glad that we're finally here and ready to go. It's been an adventure. <laughs> it's been a little interesting, hasn't it? Yes. <laughs> and, that, and that's okay. We're going to keep moving forward. So now um, you're going to be participating at our upcoming uh, Healing Through Love Day. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. The, uh, coming up in September, I think, is that correct? That's right. And what will you be, what services will you be providing for our beautiful participants? So I'm going to be doing a particular um, therapy that I call Mind Reiki. So it's okay. sort of a combination of hypnosis for healing with Reiki as well. So it's an amazing process and I'm looking forward to actually providing that because of the really deep kind of healing that you get with it. So it's an amazing thing. So what does that look like? Is it, are they, do they sit down? Do they stand up? Do so, they so basically, basically it's, it's lying down if that's possible and the whole, almost the whole process is lying down and very deep relaxation, like the level of relaxation you reach is amazing. And then just the results that you get after, also amazing. So wow, yeah. I, I want some of that, Marianne. Yeah, yeah, definitely, <laughs> you, definitely. Like, oh, we've got something scrolling on the screen right now. I'm sure it will pop back. There's a special offer, um, Complete Confidence, a five-week transformational journey. Just for viewers today, they receive a $100 discount and a free 30-minute discovery call. So that's fantastic. Maybe could would you be open to explaining a little bit more, Marianne, about your business? Yes. Yeah, so my business is One Life to Flourish and it's really all about, as you said, helping women transform their lives. And I work really with the unconscious mind, helping women to make breakthroughs with their limiting beliefs, um, emotions that are kind of blocking them from achieving what they want to achieve and that's that's what my um completely or complete completely confident i can't even say it at the moment uh <laughs> program is about is actually helping women to get through some of those blocks so that they are then confident to step into their space so it could be in business there might be something where they feel like they're being held back and they just need you know this little bit of a change they can't seem to work out what the change is. We help them to discover what that is and then they can move forward from there. Uh, could be in personal life as well. You know, if you're finding it hard to speak up 
about certain things that are happening, then it can actually help you to have the confidence to speak up. So it can be any area where you just feel like you don't have the confidence to actually step forward and step into your own personal power. Oh, so that's it, very it, beautiful, especially for our survivors because uh, yeah. we do need that soft place to land and we need to start with rebuilding ourselves really, mm-hmm. our level of confidence and our and then and then once we've got that, then we can step up and um, and embrace our new life. That's fantastic. So now how long have you been in this space and, and where is your practice and how are you doing it with COVID? Okay, so I um, have been doing particularly Reiki and the hypnosis and NLP for uh, around about a year, but I have been in the alternative therapy therapy space for 20 years or more probably more if I think about it uh, which is we're in that space I've sort of worked as a remedial massage therapist as an acupressurist you know done a whole range of different kinds of therapies so I use that as the basis now for helping people with Reiki and uh, all of the other tools that I've got so With hypnosis, with NLP, I do that online at the moment. That's been how I've been able to keep going. It works quite well online. Obviously, Reiki is a little bit harder to do online. You can do distant Reiki, but there's nothing quite like having it Mm. actually when you're there, I think. So so I um, have my at-home practice in um, Crystal Downs, so down south in Adelaide, and... uh, Yes, at the moment that's uh, I'm sort of just getting things ready to be up and going again. So at the end of the week, we'll be back to having Reiki happening on the premises and wow. amazing stuff happening. Well, that sounds fantastic. So, um, so people come to you. How do they normally book, and how do they find you? So the main way is through my Facebook page or. Uh, they can just, you know, message me, anything like that. So usually through Facebook, I've got a booking page and so on there. So if they want to get in contact with me, the best thing is probably just to book in for a discovery call and see what their needs are and go from there. Fantastic. So can you tell us a little bit more about this transformational um, program that you're running that the girls can save $100 on? Okay. So it is one that can be done online because the basis of it is around hypnosis, it's around NLP, Neuro Linguistic Programming, where we really work at uncovering what's happening at the unconscious level and then changing that. So disconnecting us from the um, links to the path that we're, our unconscious mind is clinging onto that actually stop us from moving forward. So that's a really powerful thing. And, you know, for example, I've had a client recently who's a business owner who came to me because she just lacked the confidence to do any of those things, making herself visible as a business owner. And we went through the program and she is now doing amazing things. I was just uh, messaging her on Facebook before we started because she's going, wow, this amazing thing has happened and, you know, I've sort of got got all the sales that we were talking about. So just so many amazing things happened but the most amazing thing is just for her to be so um, out there and visible to people in a really positive way. So it's sort of like this amazing energy that she's now sending out just because she was able to get you know um Mm -hmm. moving away from all of those negative emotions so it's amazingly powerful I, i love doing it just because of the way people can you know just have this fabulous transformation happening oh is there anything that you could share with our listeners today that they could take away with to make a difference for them like today so something that they could actually work on I mean, my area of passion is probably around building happiness in people because I believe that's the first step in actually opening up um, your life to be able to change. So I have lots and lots of tips around how to increase happiness and just, you know, a more positive emotional outlook. Uh, Let's see, what, what would I say? So at the moment I would 
say, look for positive things to surround yourself with. So it might be some positive quotes. It might be reading something really positive, watching a positive TV show. So particularly for people who may not be able to get outside if they're in a lockdown situation, something like that can really just help to get you ready to change. If you can get outside, then going out into nature is one of the best things to actually make you feel happier, help you to heal at a different level and, you know, be ready to make change and move forward in your life. So mm-hmm. that would be my top two things is, you know, just surround yourself with positive things. And if, if you are feeling really down, try switching off some of the negative stuff. Don't watch, you know, all the negative things on TV. Try and avoid the stuff scrolling through your Facebook yes. feed, it's, you know, sort of negative. Just try and, you know, focus on what can be positive because that will build you up. That's great tips. Concentrating on the positive. That's fantastic. So now this therapy is suitable for everyone, but you particularly work with women. Is that right? Yes, that's correct. So I can work with anyone from children, um, you know, men, women, anyone who has a need for it. But my, my focus just seems to be more on women. Maybe that's because, uh, you know, my story kind of resonates a little bit with them where I've, you know, overcome my personal struggles with depression and things like that through this, you know, same kind of process and how, how I've moved forward with that. But, yes, open to anyone and, you know, the um, offer for anyone watching, as we said, was $100 off, off the program. So it's, you know, quite a good thing to invest in if you really feel like you you know want to deal with some of the emotional baggage really that it's you know kind of carrying around weighing you down that sort of thing oh that's fantastic so that's brilliant it's been fantastic chatting with you is there anything that you'd like to leave our listeners with today i think i would like to leave leave them with the fact that there is always hope that you can make changes in your life like nothing is ever going to be as dark as you know sometimes it feels there's always a way through and there's always a way out and you know there's people out there ready to support you if that's the situation that you're in and I think that's part of you know what what we're all here for today is for the support that you give people who are in that dark place I think so so there's always hope and you just need to hang in there That's fantastic. Oh, thank you so much for sharing. I just can't wait to see you again in person. Um, That's going to be very soon. And so, yes, you're right, that's in September, so we're going to be sharing that space. Um, Rose will be chasing you to make sure your paperwork's filled in. (laughs) Yes, I know. I'll look forward to hearing from Rose. (laughs) And it's going to be an amazing opportunity. We're at a new location Mm. as well, so it's a little closer for you this year. And, um, yeah, so in Woodville. And it'll be great to have your beautiful face there and sharing your light and loving energy. It's fantastic. All right, and we've got that screening up on the up here again. So special offer today, complete confidence, five-week transformational journey. Four viewers receive a hundred dollar discount and a free 30-minute discovery call. So it'll be great to see you in that space. Thank you so much, Mary Ann. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much. Now, girls, we're going to go to a very quick commercial from our sponsors. Our sponsors are Be Live T3. Oh my gosh, I'll stick my teeth back in. Be Live TV through My Time TV. So we're going to go to a quick commercial. Or not? <laughs> Hello, um, I am really sorry. We're having some really um, major tech issues today. Lindley will um, be here, but she will not be able to be seen. We're having some issues with her camera, but we can still talk to her and you can look at our p- pretty purple screen. So in the meantime, I will bring Charlene back up and she can speak with Lindley to a purple screen. So here we go.
Hello, amazing people. I hope all finds you well. And thank you so much for coming back after our beautiful break. So I would like to introduce to you a personal friend, in fact, Lindley Evans. And uh, Lindley and I have been um, doing life together for a little while. Lindley is a coach and she's also a coach in hypnosis as well, who works at a, a Good Evans Consulting. Uh, that's a play on her last name, I'm sure, uh, where <laughs> she has been successful in coaching and, and currently assisting men and women of the age of 40 and over develop career confidence. Lindley went through a difficult time herself early in life, particularly at work, and this then brought her to finding ways um, through all of her emotions and her living beliefs and feeling, feeling trapped um, and the environment did not suit her. Her online program, Work Confidence System, is a fantastic way to move from overwhelm to a feeling that you can cope. Lindley, without any further ado, I won't keep reading your bio because it's very large. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to introduce Lindley. Lindley, I know that we can't see your beautiful face, but I know you're there because I can hear you. Could you tell us a little bit about why you work in the domestic violence space in Healing Through Love? Okay, I got introduced. Oh, hello, everyone. Yeah, um, I got introduced to um, the domestic violence um, space um, actually by Charlene. <laughs> However, um, what really um, motivated me to go down that path was the fact that it was so much like what I'd been through. Um, even though I'd, I'd been bullied. So domestic violence is another form of bullying and it it was one way in which I was able, I, if I'm able to work my way through, I'm able to help others work their way through it as well because it's a very similar path to get um, to, to where you want to be. Oh, that's beautiful, Lindley. And you're sharing with us um, nine tips to build self-confidence, and that's in a PDF. And the girls um, can just click on the link and that will take them to the PDF. And that's all around self-confidence and um, and reaching that higher levels of self-confidence. Now, you use a variety of techniques, I understand, in your practice. So could you maybe take a few minutes to explain to us the, the variety of techniques that you use? Okay, so I'm qualified... Um, as a as a life coach but during so obviously i used coaching techniques i i uh, use nlp which is neuro linguistic programming for those that don't know um i use timeline therapy i use timeline therapy and matrix therapy which are basically the same pro, pro, uh, program or method but one is masculine and one is feminine and one will actually take you that step deeper um, which is the matrix therapy, and I'm a master practitioner in that. Um, so, and and hypnosis trained as well. <laughs> so, um, a master practitioner in, in hypnosis. So, uh, yes, I've done a, a lot of work on that side. And now, of course, uh, I've just spent a, w a weekend at boot camp with the Speakers Institute. So, obviously, I'm now uh, part of the Speakers Tribe and will be. Um, speaking more in the future um i think this is my first <laughs> first uh, uh bit on on that side of things so oh. um i look forward to that as well well you're doing great just saying that's fantastic Lindley. even though we can't see your face we can hear your smiling voice so wow what a passion to come from that place yourself and then to have gone through that journey and now be in a place where with your techniques and your technologies you can help people move through this space into a different area that's brilliant so where do you normally practice your uh, so do you go to people's places or do you actually have a um, a coaching practice somewhere they come to like how does that work normally not outside of covid how does it normally work um most of my stuff has been done online um i did start having a practice face to face um but i found that more people were wanting it online and so um i i then changed it to being um online only and um, then COVID hit us. And so I was in a good place um, for, to just continue um, to do what I was doing. And um, I developed my online program during that time as well. Mm. Oh, fantastic. Okay, so now how do people get hold of you? Like, how do they find you? Well, they can either go to my 
if they can have a look further at what I do on my website, um, which is probably being listed, but it's goodevansconsulting.com. Um, you can also get me on Facebook. Um, they can look up my, I've got a business page, but I've also got a personal page, which I do a lot of my um, business stuff on as well. Um, I also have an Instagram page as well as a LinkedIn profile as well. And um, yes, and I have a, a, a Facebook group, um, which is called Developing Career Confidence. Fantastic. So um, we might have to get you one of those little e-business cards so it's all in one place and you can just flick that. And that, that really might, be a, that might be a good idea when I think about how many I've got. I got know. There. I've, I've moved away from business cards because all the details change so regularly. As a, a multi-passionate entrepreneur, we do a lot of pivoting. And so it just an electronic card is just so much easier now than a paper one. And it saves trees too. <laughs> <laughs> So now the people that come and seek your help, you said that they're men and women, but do you have clients that are more women than men or how, what sort of... Generally more women than we, generally more women than men, if I can get that out. And most of it is in work, workspace environment, most of it? Most of it's in the workspace or um, people that are having a lot of anger issues. The first part of my course, which I have actually made into a, a smaller program, um, is about um, emotional resilience and mm. so it's overcoming those initial uh, emotions to start with because you can't move forward and do, until you've, you've done that. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that's great. Now, so you're going to be joining us in September to share the love with our beautiful ladies who are survivors of domestic and family violence. So what type of a service will you be doing for them in that space on the day? On the space, I think I'll be doing a bit of hypnosis um, on the day. Um, to right. it, what does that look like? Um, what does that look like, Lynn Lee? Does it, do they sit down? Do they stand up? Do they lie down? Well, how does it work with hypnosis? Um, just sit down. Um, they just sit down in a very relaxed sort of uh, manner and um, they can just sit there, close their eyes and just listen to my voice. Excellent. So and your key thing that you'll be taking them through, will it be around confidence? Yeah, um, it, it will take them through uh, a, a small amount of confidence. Over, um, it'll start to let them relax and release a lot of what they're doing and move them towards the confidence, yes. That's fantastic. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. It's great. So what's next for you then? You know, you've uh, you've done the boot camp and now you've come out, you're a professional public speaker. So what's next for you, Marianne? Uh, sorry, Lindley, moving forward. I'm not seeing your face. I need to see your face. <laughs> I'm a face person. I can I'm see your gonna, face. I'm I can see my face, face. But, I, but you just can't see me. So this is really, really very interesting. Um, <laughs> I love you. However, so tell me what's um, next for you. Next, I think, is um, trying to develop my speaking skills a bit further because, I mean, obviously I've just had two days fairly intense, uh, in, intensive, and um, I got so much good feedback from that um, that weekend that um, maybe we'll, we'll see how it goes for the next uh, few months and hopefully that will help me also to get my name out for what I'm doing because I am fairly new to this space. So um, so it's a good opportunity um, to, to do that. Excellent, excellent. So was there anything part of that conversation that you had at boot camp that you'd like to share with us today? Well, what I was um, looking at boot, boot camp, we, we went down the track of, um, I went down the track of stress um, at boot camp and um, I think I was looking at stress dynamics. Um, and what, what how is to, stress dynamics? What is stress dynamics? And how to how to change your mindset um, on looking at the way you approach things in your work environment, mm -hmm. um, releasing or, or changing your, yourself into like a gratitude sort of state of mind when you walk into your work environment can make a, such a huge impact on the way you, you view the, the people. And not only that, 
it's a different way that they see you and they respond on, on wow. that score. That's fantastic. So stress dynamics. So this is another thing that you help people with. If they've got work-related stress, you specifically help them with work-related stress issues. That's fantastic. That's so you've got people that are looking for confidence and people that have got work stress. And uh, so there's a variety of things that you're helping people with. That's correct. Excellent. And this is using your range of modalities. Yes, it is. So you assess them to figure out which one is going to best suit them and then use those modalities to get them from where they are to where they want to be. That's right. Um, first of all, we would have, um, if it's an individual client, we would have a 30-minute um, um, discover, free discovery call. And then we would work out where they wanted to, where they wanted to be, um, and how we, and the steps to get there. Oh, fantastic! It sounds wonderful. Sounds wonderful. Is there anything else that you'd like to share with our listeners today? Especially, I'm looking at from the perspective of domestic violence and family violence. And uh, is there anything that you'd like to share with us in that space? Um, from domestic violence, um, family violence, um, I think. Um, to let them know that there is a way through um, and that uh, there's lots of us that are here to help you. Um, you don't have to do it alone um, and it is something you will need help with. Um, there's many coaches out there that are able to help in, in this space um, and um, I'm just one of them. That's fantastic. It's been a wonderful interview. I know it's been a bit strange today because we've had all sorts of gremlins in the machines not letting us actually move forward and start the broadcast. And then now we can't see your beautiful face. So something is out there happening. We're not quite sure. And that's okay. We'll still make this video available and the broadcast available and make sure that you can stream it on your, and maybe you can put your face over the top of it. <laughs> <laughs> That could work. Um, you can stream it on your page as well. Girls, it's been an amazing event. Lindley, was there anything you'd like to say in closing? No, I think we've probably covered it all, but um, thank you for having me on today. Fantastic. Now, um, thank you so much, Lindley. And boys and girls, you can contact Lindley through her page and she's got those nine tips to build confidence and that's a PDF, so all you need to do is click the link. So we're going to have the rest of the ladies come back and join us. Um, to the left and to the right of me, we will have Ali and Rose pop up. Hello, Ali and Rose. It's happening. Woo! Oh, and Lindley's still here too. And she's still purple. That's okay. We know she's there. So fantastic. Hello, ladies. How are you? Isn't it been interesting behind the scenes? Just saying. <laughs> well, hello, I don't know. But yes, it's been um, it's been quite a challenge today. And uh, yeah, I'm not really sure what's going on, but I'm sure we'll get it sorted out by next week because yeah, this is just um, <laughs> I don't know if you can see what you mean. becoming <laughs> becoming um yeah. Uh, uh, problem uh it, no there's no such thing as a problem everything is a challenge and we're going to resolve this challenge thank you for joining us today if you would like to be involved in healing through love as either an exhibitor and sharing the love to pay it forward for ladies who have been survivors of domestic and family violence we would ask you to contact rose or healing through love we've got a facebook page and let us know that you're interested in actually paying it forward. That would be great. If you're a survivor or if you have a friend or a family member who's a survivor, also reach out. We've got a fantastic event coming up in September and we would welcome you, if you're in South Australia, to come along and feel the love. Our email address is HTL Healing Through Love. So that's HTL Adelaide at gmail.com. Be sure to meet us next time. So that's next week at 1 o'clock. We've got Ali hosting two amazing guests. Girls, is there anything more to say before we close? Yeah, if um, anyone wants to appear on um, the Healing Through Love show, please um, reach out to us at our email address at htladelaide at gmail.com. And, yeah, just put your name forward and uh, we'll be in touch because we, we're always looking for uh, dynamic people to, to appear on our show. God bless. It's wonderful to see you all. Have a great day. And Bye, stay everyone. Warm. <laughs>